Let's just yeah. start in a comfortable seated position. Um, we're just going to our hands on our knees and just close your eyes here and just start with our breath. Some nice big inhales and nice long, long exhales. Maybe feel your shoulders start to soften. Your whole body just start to relax a little bit with each exhale. And just focus on your breath. With each inhale, feel your belly rise with air. Maybe even pause a second or two. And then with each exhale, slowly, slowly releasing all that air out. A few more breaths here. Just starting to come into your place on your mat. Taking this next hour off for yourself, the listening to your body, doing what's right, what's best for you this afternoon, what you need. So making this practice all about you, your practice, your class. A couple more nice, deep, deep breaths here. And then opening our eyes, let's inhale, reach our arms around and up. Clasp your hands, reach your palms up, inhale. As you exhale, bring those palms in front, stretching your upper back, reach out here. Inhale, back up. And as you exhale, turn to the right. One breath here, inhale. As you exhale, bring your left hand, your right knee, right hand behind you, so inhale, lengthen. And as you exhale, slowly twist. Gradually come back around, let's inhale, reach, reach up. Clasp your hands, reach your palms up, inhale. As you exhale, turn to the left. Inhale here. Exhale, right hand to left knee. Inhale, lengthen, and exhale, twist. Slowly come back around, let's inhale, reach, reach up. This time as you exhale, bring both palms in front. <clears throat> lengthen your spine, you can stay here, you can tiptoe those fingertips forward, release that head. Keep your hips grounded though as you lengthen over here. And walk both palms to the right, lengthen at our left side. Now stay here. Maybe take your left palm on top of that right, push that left hip back, get a nice side stretch. And then come back to center. Let's walk both palms to the left, lengthen in our right side. Stay here. Maybe take that right palm on top of your left, push that right hip back. Come back to center. Let's tiptoe those fingertips back. From here, clasp your hands behind you. Pull those shoulder blades together as you pull those arms back up in our chest. One more big breath, inhale. And you exhale, release, shake those shoulders out. All right, let's come on our hands and knees in our tabletop position. So wrist under shoulders, knees under hips. Just starting to warm up our spine with our cat cow. So as you inhale, arch your spine, lift your chest, look up. Exhale all that air up, rounding your spine, releasing that heavy head. Once again, inhaling up and exhaling out. So just moving back and forth at your pace with your breath. With each exhale, really round that spine. Pull your abdominals all the way to your spine here. Let's do one more big inhale. Nice, long, long rounding exhale. And then meeting back in tabletop. Let's try our side stretches. So inhale. As you exhale, let your hips fall over to the right. Look over that left shoulder. <clears throat> inhale back to center. And exhale to the left. Look over your right shoulder. Inhale, center. Exhale to the right. Inhale, center. Exhale to the left. One more time each side. Back to center. Release to the right. Back to center. Release to the left. And then meeting back in tabletop, let's try our spinal balance. So take your left arm and right leg and reach, reach out here, lengthen out, reach those fingertips out as you reach it, right leg behind you. 
All right, we're going to move your inhale. As you exhale, pull your elbow and knee to center. Everything in. Inhale, reach, reach back out. Exhale in. Inhale back out. Exhale in. Inhale, reach, reach out. Exhale in. Inhale, reach out here. And stay here. Grab that back foot. Maybe push that foot into your palm. Look over that left shoulder. Get a little twist here. And then meeting back into tabletop. Let's take our right arm and left leg out. Reach, reach out. Leap it out here. Reach your fingertips out. You should reach that left leg behind you. One more breath here. Inhale. As you exhale, pull everything to center. Inhale, lengthen, lengthen out. Exhale in. Inhale, reach back out. Exhale to center. One more time. Inhale out. Exhale in. Inhale, reach, reach out here. And stay here or grab that back foot. Maybe look over that right shoulder. And meeting back in tabletop. All right, we're going to move through a little flow here and get up and down dog. So as you inhale, arch your spine, lift your chest, look up. As you exhale, sit back on those heels for one breath. Inhale, back up. And exhale to down dog. All right, back on our knees. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, sit back. Inhale, up. Exhale to down dog. Once again on our knees, inhale, lift up, exhale, sit back. Inhale up, exhale, down dog. All right, we're gonna do three more. So you can come on your knees or you can come into a plank and slowly coming down. Inhaling up and exhaling to down dog. Either one on your knees or in a plank, your choice here. So whichever you prefer to do. Couple more rounds. And when you're in that last down dog, let's walk this dog out. Then one leg, then the other back and forth, stretching those legs out, moving with your breath at your pace here. And when you're ready, bring those heels to stillness. Reach back here. One more big breath. Inhale. And you're still walk all the way up to the top of our mat. And we're going to come down into a toe stretch. So I'm going to come all the way down on my knees. So sitting back on your heels, stretching those toes. This is hard, but it's so good for us. Just a little longer here. Keep breathing here. All right, let's put our hands down and just slap those toes. Feels good. <clears throat> and then we're going to sit back and either Thunderbolt or Hero. So if you have something you want to put a block or a, just a cushion to sit on or sit back on your heels if you're okay here. You have a blanket, everybody good? Because we're going to do, do a few wrist stretches this evening. So bring your left arm up. This would be good for being on the computer a lot. So I'm going to put my palm up and pull those fingers back. Sit, stretching that wrist. Now release. Okay, fingers facing down. Put your hand on your palm and just pull your top of your hand and pull back. Release, let's make circles. I like to make it like a fist and release those fingers, just stretching those wrists and those fingers. One way, then the other way, change directions. All right, release, let's bring our right hand up. So my palm's facing forward, pull those fingers back, stretch back here. It really gets under your arm, the inside of the arm. Release. Fingers facing down, pull back. Release. 
interlace. Now make circles here, maybe make fists with your fingers. One way to another way, rotate that fist around. And then release. And now we are going to come into a little balance on our toes. So I'm coming back on my toes. See if you can bring your knees up. Find something still to focus on. Grip that mat, maybe hands to prayer. Let's see if you come all the way up and release. Good job, good. All right, good. All right, come back to the top of our neck. I'll stretch out here. Let's inhale, reach those arms up. Grab your left wrist and release to the right. Stretch over to the right, lengthen in that left side. Come back up, grab your right wrist, release to the left, lengthen in our right side. Back to center, let's come to a forward fold. So starting with a little bend in your knees, let your whole body release down here and just hang lift like a rag doll. Release that heavy head, you move back and forth, let those arms dangle here. And if you want, you can hold your elbows, picture frame your face, maybe nod your head up and down like you're saying yes. Back and forth like you're saying no. You're releasing your elbows, bring your palms together, starting with a little bend in your knees. As you inhale, reach those fingertips up to the sky. Exhale back with a little back bend. Inhale back up, and let's exhale our hands to prayer. Releasing our arms here, come back to Dyson, our mountain pose, relaxing those shoulders, grounding your feet. A couple of nice deep breaths here. One more inhale, and exhale. Ah, let's inhale, reach your ground and up, lift, lift up. As you exhale, fold. Inhale, look up with a flat back. As you exhale, bring that left foot back into our runner's line. So keep that right foot ground as you reach that left heel back. A nice stretch here. One more breath, inhale. As you exhale, bring your right arm up. Move into a twist, maybe those right fingertips. Release down, so both hands at the top of the mat. Drop that back knee, turn your toes down. Just let that right knee extend forward here, stretching forward here. One more breath, inhale. As you exhale, just go walk those hands back, straighten that right leg. You can flex that foot or point those toes. You flex your foot, you feel that stretch. If you point your toes, you're gonna stretch in the top of that foot, wherever you wanna go here. Then I'm going to bend your front knee, walk those fingertips forward. We're going to move into half moon on the right side. So right hand can come in front of you. If you have a block near it, you can block to the floor. Beginning to turn to the left, move it into your half moon. Open it up here. Good. One more breath. Inhale. It's six out of four both. Back foot meets front. And we're going to inhale, reach those arms, round it up, lift, lift up. And exhale, fold. Inhale, look up with a flat back. As you exhale, bring your right foot back. So keep that left foot grounded as you reach that right heel back. Get a nice stretch down our right leg. One more breath, inhale, exhale your left arm up. Maybe look at those left fingertips, get a nice spinal twist. Release down, drop that back knee, turn your chest, let that left knee extend forward. One more breath, your inhale. Make sure exhale begin to walk those hands back, straighten that left leg. Flex that foot or point those toes, either one.
And then let's bend that knee, slide those fingertips forward. We'll move to half moon on the left side. So bring your left hand in front of you here. Begin to turn to the right, right arm up, right leg up, open up here. One more breath, inhale, exhale back to forward fold. And inhale, reach your arms around and up. And then exhale by your side. Back turn to Dasner Mount Pose. Nice grounding breath here. So from here, we'll go through our first vinyasa. If you want to skip it, go right to down dog. As you inhale, reach your arms around and up. As you exhale, fold. Inhaling, look up with a flat back. Exhale, step back into your plank. Move through your vinyasa, your pace, your breath here. We'll all meet in downward facing dog. From here, let's inhale our right leg up, reach it to the sky. As you exhale, bend your knee, let your foot fall to the left. Keep that right knee lifted, lifted high, opening our hip. Inhale back up high, and as you exhale, bring your right foot forward. We'll meet our crescent lunge. Front knee over our ankle, reach those fingertips up here. Lengthen as your spine as you reach, reach up high here. Good. All right, we're gonna move a little bit here. Turn your palms forward. We're gonna take a big breath. Inhale. As you exhale, we're gonna release those hands down. Just release all the way down. <sighs> big exhale. Inhale, lift, lift back up. And exhale all that out. <sighs> Inhale, palms facing forward, lift up to the sky. Exhale out. <sighs> Once again, inhale, lift, lift up. Exhale out. <sighs> inhale, good. Nice, busy. Inhale, reach, reach up. Exhale, hands to prayer. One breath here, inhale. Exhale, twist to the right. Move to your prayer twist. You can stay in your twist. You can open up. You want to bring one arm down, one arm up. It's up to you. One more breath, inhale. Exhale, hands to top the mat. Step back to your plank. Go through your vinyasa. Right to down dog. From here, let's inhale our left leg up, reach it up high. Just don't bend your knee, let your foot fall to the right. Keep that left knee lifted, lifted high, opening our hip. Inhale back up. As you exhale, bring your left foot forward. Sweep those arms up for our crescent lunge. Reach those fingertips up. All right, we're going to get ready to move here. So think about nice big inhales and really long, long exhales. So palms facing for inhale, exhale, all that out. <sighs> inhale, reach, reach up high. Exhale out. <sighs> inhale, lift, lift up. Exhale out. <sighs> Once again, palms forward, reach, reach up, lift, lift up. Exhale out. <sighs> inhale, reach, reach up. As you exhale, bring hands to prayer. One breath here, inhale. Exhale, let's twist to the left. Move into your prayer twist here. Stay here, open up here. One more breath, inhale. Exhale, hands to the top of the mat. Step back to your plank, go through your vinyasa, right to down dog. From here, let's inhale our right leg up, reach it up high. As you exhale, bend your knee, let your foot fall to the left. So stay here or flip your dog wherever you are. Good. Nice job. Keep those hips lifted. Good. All right, gracefully flip back over. Let's bring that right leg back up high. Inhale. As you exhale, bring your right foot forward. Sweep those arms up for warrior one. Reach those fingertips up here, lengthen up here. Spread your fingers out, strong fingers, hands, arms. 
All right, one more big breath. Inhale. You should still bring those arms behind you. Clasp your hips. Pull your shoulder blades together. Maybe arch your spine. Look up. Now we're going to move into a flow here. So inhale. As you exhale for one breath, you're going to release that head down. Bring those arms up. Now inhale. Reach, reach back up. Lift that up. Pull those arms behind you. Exhale. Release everything down. Once again, inhale back up. Exhaling down. One more time with your breath here. You inhale, lift, lift up. Arch your spine, look up to the sky. And exhale, release everything down and let's hold here. So bring those arms up. Pull those shoulder blades together, open in our chest. One more breath, inhale. Let's exhale to standing splits. Hands to the top of the mat. Keep that left leg up high. Reach, reach that left leg up. Maybe work on your balance, maybe not today. Lift up high for one more breath. Inhale. We're going to extend a chair. Left foot meets right. Weight back in our heels. Sit back here. But bring those arms up. Breathe here. All right, now we're going to come all the way up. Keep those arms lifted up because we're going to move into eagle. So bring your left arm under your right, binding our arms here. Left leg over right. So bend your knees. Pull those thighs together. Try to reach those elbows up here. Maybe up to your shoulders. Now you can keep that left foot on the ground. You can bring it up. You can come into a bind. Keep breathing here. Now keep those arms bound. We're going to move into warrior three with bound arms. So just release that leg, bring that leg behind you. Use your arms come in front. Nice steady breaths here. Find your gist to your gaze. One more breath, inhale. Exhale, drop that back foot down. Keep those arms bound, turn sideways. Lift those elbows up, one breath, inhale. Exhale, release to warrior two. One breath, inhale, exhale, hands to the top of the mat, step back to your plank, go through your vinyasa, right to down dog. All right, from here, when you're ready, let's inhale our left leg up, reach it up. You should still bend your knee, let your foot fall to the right, stay here or flip your dog. Nice, nice. Keep those hips lifted up. Gracefully flip back over. Let's bring that left leg back up high. Inhale. And as you exhale, bring it forward for warrior one. Sweep those arms around and up. Lift those fingertips up. Reach up high here. Okay, let's come Lift, lift up for one more breath. Inhale. Exhale, bring those arms behind you. Clasp your hands. Pull your shoulder blades together. You should reach those arms back. Or we're going to move into our flow here. Inhale. As you exhale, let that head release down for one breath. Inhale, lift, lift back up. Reach those arms back. Exhale, everything down. Inhale, back up. Exhale, down. One last time. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, let your whole body cascade down and hold here. Hold here. Opening our chest, opening our heart. Keep breathing here. One more breath. Inhale. Exhale, hands to the top of the mat. Move in your standing splits. Keep that right leg up high. Lift, lift up high here. Just let your head drop towards your knee. Maybe work on your balance, maybe not. Lift up high for one more breath. Inhale, 
Exhale, bring your right foot to meet your left. Weight back in our heels. Let's sit low. One more chair. Maybe sitting a little lower the second time. Deep breathing. Come all the way up, reach those fingertips up. And we're gonna to move to eagle on the left side. So right arm under left, bind in our arms, reach those elbows up, and then right leg over left, sitting low here. And whatever variation you wanna take, you can stay here, you can bring that right leg up, you can come into your bind. Look straight ahead here. Focus here. Keep those arms bound. Let's see if we can move to warrior three. Keep that left leg strong. Letting your body pivot here. One more breath. Inhale. Exhale. Bring that right leg back in our wide stance. Let's move to warrior two. Stretch those arms out. One breath. Inhale. Exhale, hands to top the mat, step back to your plank, go through your vinyasa, right to down dog. Or if you like, take a break in child's pose. It's up to you. When you're ready, we'll all meet down, we're facing dog. All right, from here, let's inhale our right leg up, reach it up. And your exhale, bring it forward for warrior one. Sweep those arms around and up. Lift up high. One more breath, inhale. And let's exhale to warrior two. Adjust that back foot out towards the center of the room. Front knee still over our ankle. Reach those arms. We're gonna have that strong right middle finger. You reach, reach those fingertips out like you wanna push, reach both walls in front and behind you. One more breath here. Inhale. Let's exhale to peace warrior. Drop that back hand. Right arm comes up and over. Either looking up or looking down here. Lengthen in our right side. One more breath here. Inhale. Exhale to extended side angle. Drop your right forearm down. Left arm comes up and over. Reach those fingertips forward. As you push on that left hand. Feel that stretch all the way down the left side of our body. And lots of variations here. You could stay here. You can bring that left arm behind you, come into your bind. You can bring both arms in front if you'd like. You can come to Birds of Paradise, wherever you all want to go here. It's your choice, your choice. Nice, nice, Phyllis. One more breath here, inhale. Let's exhale back to warrior two. All right, from here, we're gonna need to triangle, straighten that front leg, reach, reach that right arm out as far as you can. Slowly bring our right arm down, left arm up, open up here with those left fingertips, lift up high. One more breath, inhale, exhale, back to warrior two. And release your arms down, come into a wide stance. Bring your toes facing out. We're gonna come into a little twist here, stretch our lower back. So, so we're gonna sit low. My hands are right above my knees. Just let my head kind of shrug in between my shoulder blades. You got it, so inhale. As you exhale, bring that left shoulder in, look over to the right, a nice side stretch. Inhale back to center. And exhale to the left, bring that right shoulder in. Inhale back to center. Let's exhale to the right, really get a nice twist. Good. Inhale back to center. Exhale to the left, get a nice twist here. Back to center. Exhale to the right. Inhale center. Exhale to the left. 
Let's do one more time each side. Inhale, center. Exhale to the right. Inhale, center. Exhale to the left. Back to center. Now pick up your heels so your toes are pointed forward or pitch your toe to in. And we're just going to release the wide-legged forward fold. Just slowly release down. You can walk those hands back. Releasing that heavy head. Just let gravity bring you down here. Breathe here. One more breath, inhale. As you exhale, walk your hands back to center, bring a little bend to your knees. Slowly, slowly roll up one vertebrae at a time. And then let's turn our right foot forward, but let's just step back to our plank, go through our vinyasa, right to down dog, just change your sides here. So however you want to get there. From here, let's inhale our left leg up, reach it up high. As you exhale, bring your left foot forward. Sweep those arms up for warrior one, lift up high here. One more breath, inhale. Let's exhale to warrior two, just that back foot, front knee still over ankle, reach those arms out here. Reach, reach those arms out, you should push on both feet, strong arms and legs here. One more breath here, inhale. Exhale to Peaceful Warrior. Back hand down, left arm up and over, looking up or looking down here. One more breath, inhale. Exhale to extended side angle. Left forearm comes down. It's right arm comes up and over. Reach, reach those fingertips forward. You push on that right heel for our line of energy all the way down the right side of our body. and whatever variation you'd like to take here. Making this your pose, so go where you want to go. Just keep breathing here. Nice job. One more breath, inhale. And let's exhale back to warrior two. One breath here, inhale. Let's extend a triangle, straighten that front leg, reach, reach that left arm out. Slowly bring our left arm down, right arm up, open up here. One more breath, inhale. Exhale back to warrior two. Hands atop the mat, step back to your plank, go through one more vinyasa. Right to down dog or right to child's pose. Well, I'll end up child's pose whenever you're ready. So whenever you're ready, bring those knees to the edge of the mat, sit back and release back here. And just breathe. Just breathe, coming back to that nice deep breath. Inhale. And slowly, slowly exhale all that air out. A few more nice deep breaths here. Just letting those hips sink down to the mat. All right, let's take one more breath here. Inhale. As you exhale, slowly roll up. And from here, we're gonna move into a forearm plank. And that's the strength in our core. So coming on our forearms, I like to even make fists here. I'm gonna walk my knees back. All right, when you're ready, bring those knees up. So try to keep your body straight line, really engage your core here. Use your bond to strength. Reach that forehead forward as you reach those heels back. Keep breathing. Best thing we can do is strengthen our core. Few more breaths. 
One more inhale. And she exhale, come all the way down. We're gonna move into Sphinx. I think this feels so good. Forearms parallel to the side of the mat. Lift your chest, but soften your shoulders behind you. Release that lower back, your glutes. And just breathe, just breathe. Just enjoy this nice release in your lower back here. Maybe feeling that lower back sink a little lower with each exhale. We'll be here just a little longer. You can stay here or you can move into seal, hands to the corner of the mat, lift up here. Keep breathing a little longer here. One more big breath, inhale, lift up. And check, so slowly come down. So just come down on your chin here, bring your arms behind you, palms facing up, and we're gonna move into locus. So as you inhale, raise your head and chest and arms, you can bring those legs up. Lift, lift up, strengthen the whole back of our body, keep moving. One more breath, inhale, exhale down on one cheek. We're gonna move into one more back bend here. You can come back to Sphinx, you can go back to Locust, or you can come to Bow. You wanna bend your knees, grab your feet or ankles, wherever you are, when you're ready, lift up here. You're in Bow, keep those feet in your hands, lift, lift up, open our chest, keep breathing. One more breath, inhale, exhale on one cheek. Keep your knees bent, let your feet flop from side to side like windshield wipers, release to that lower back. And then bring your feet to stillness. Once again, we'll push back to child's pose. Knees edge of the mat, sit back on your heels. Release back here and just breathe, just breathe. One more breath here, inhale. And exhale, slowly come back on your knees. Let's bring those knees together. And we're gonna set up, go back to down dog just so we can move into pigeon. So bring your hands to the top of the mat, spread those fingers out. When you're ready, come on your toes, lift those hips up. And from here, let's inhale our right leg up, reach it up high. As you exhale, bring your right knee, right foot forward. If you'd like to bring any kind of prop, if you have a cushion or blanket or pillow you want to put into that right hip, feel free to. And then bringing our fingertips outside the mat, we'll move into this slowly. So as you inhale, lift your chest, look up. As you exhale, bend those elbows, gradually cascade down. Once again, inhale up, let your head be the last thing. And you exhale, slowly, slowly release down. One more time, inhale, lift, lift up. 
As you exhale this time, let your whole body cascade down. And just breathe, just breathe. Resting that head on those arms, on the mat, any kind of props you have here. Just letting any tension carrying those hips, just let it melt away here. Just breathe. So with each exhale, maybe feeling those hips soften just a little more. And just focus on your breath. Inhaling, slowly, slowly exhaling all that air out. few more deep breaths here. In fact, let's just do one more inhale. As you exhale, walk those hands back, lift your chest up. And stay here, maybe grab that back foot, maybe bring that right arm up wherever you wanna go here. One more breath, inhale, exhale, release. Let's just turn sideways here. Keep that left leg extended. Bring the sole of that right foot into your left thigh here. The fingertips behind you here, sit up straight and tall. As you inhale, reach that right arm up. You should still let that left hand just glide down that left leg, releasing over here, stretching over, stretching that good stretch in our right side. And then slowly come back to center. Maybe adjust your hips. We're just going to bring our fingertips in front of us. Stay here, tiptoe those fingertips forward. Maybe let that left foot fall back to the left. Get a little more up in that left inner thigh. Breathe here. One more breath, inhale. As you exhale, let's tiptoe those fingertips back. And then bring your hands behind you. Lift up on those fingertips for one breath here, inhale. As you exhale, take that left hand, your right knee move to a gentle twist. So inhale, lengthen up. And as you exhale, just slowly begin to turn to the right, just a gentle twist. A few breaths here as you inhale, lengthen, and as you exhale, twist. And at your last exhale, slowly come back to center. And let's just bring our hands to the top of the mat. Come back on both knees. I'm just trying to size. And we'll meet back and down dog. Stretch and those legs out. Maybe bring that right leg up, shake it out, or walk this dog out. Whatever's good for you here. Come up on your toes if it feels good. Numbers, he will reverse his. Getting a nice stretch in our right leg. And then let's inhale that left leg up, reach it up. And you exhale, bring your left knee, left foot forward. Using any props we'd like under that left hip. And 
And then when you're ready, bring those fingertips outside the mat. As you inhale, lift, lift up, look up, get a nice throat opening. Exhale, bend those elbows, gradually stand. Once again, nice fluid movement in your side. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, release. Last round. Inhale all the way up. As you exhale, let your whole body cascade down. And just breathe. Just breathe. Softening with each exhale. Eventually, just letting those hips melt down to the mat. A few more nice deep breaths here. Take one more big inhale. Nice long, long exhale. So walking those hands back, lifting our chest up here. And stay here. Maybe grab that back foot. Maybe bring that left arm up. It's up to you here. Nice. And then releasing down. Let's turn sideways so our right leg stays extended. The sole of our left foot comes into our right thigh. All right, fingertips behind you, lengthen your spine here. So as you inhale, reach that left arm up, you exhale, let that right hand just fly down that right leg. Lengthen in that left side, breathe here. Slowly coming back up. Just your hips here if you need to. And then bring those fingertips in front. Maybe slowly tiptoe those fingertips forward, lengthen in our spine here. Maybe let that right foot go out to the side, breathe here. One more breath, inhale. As you exhale, tiptoe those fingertips back. Bring those fingertips behind you. Lengthen your spine, inhale. As you exhale, right hand to left knee. Gentle twist here, inhale, lengthen, lengthen up. As you exhale, slowly begin to twist. Inhale up and exhale, twist. A couple more breaths here. And at your last deck. So come back to center and pick up that left leg. We're just going to come to a wide-legged forward fold, getting a nice stretch in our legs. So reach those legs out. Flex your feet a little bit here. 
Inhale, lengthen your spine. As you exhale, bring those hands in front of you. Slowly, slowly, maybe tiptoe those fingertips forward, lengthen forward here. Keep breathing here. One more breath, inhale, exhale. Bring those, walk those fingertips back. Pick up one leg, bring it in, the other leg. Hug those knees, lift up here. So we've just got a minute, a couple of minutes left. I'm gonna let you all come to whatever version you wanna do. If you just wanna bring your legs up, you wanna do shoulder stand, practice your head stand. Just to get those feet up for that last couple of minutes here. Anything y'all wanna do. So just breathe here, Phyllis and Missy, just breathe here. Getting those feet up, so good for us. First in the flow of blood in our body. Take one more breath, inhale, exhale, bend those knees, gradually bring your feet down. And if you want to do fish, if you breaths, any kind of counter pose you want to do here. And then whenever you're ready, just take your time. Whenever you're ready, we're just going to move into our Shabbat's in our final resting pose. <laughs> so just whenever you're ready, Bring those arms by your side. Let your feet flop out to the side. And just breathe here. Mm. Let your whole body completely relax. So feel your eyes soften. Your cheeks, your jaws relax. Release your shoulders, your elbows, your wrist, down to your fingertips. Your hips, your thighs, your knees, your ankles, down to the tips of your toes. And just breathe. Just breathe.
slowly begin to deepen your breath. Wiggle your fingers, your toes, just gradually awaken in our bodies. Inhale, your arms above your head for a long body stretch. And as you exhale, hug your knees into your chest. Give yourself a big hug. And gradually roll over on one side. And when you're ready, keeping our eyes closed, just slowly bringing ourselves up to back up to a comfortable seated position. Taking a few nice deep breaths here. Slowly bringing our awareness back, gradually coming back into our day. And just remembering through all this uncertainty we have in our lives right now, all these things going on in our lives, just remember we can always come back to our mat. We can always come back to that peacefulness, that calmness that we get when we come back to our yoga mat. I want to thank you both for taking the time to spend with me this evening, and I wish you all the very best. Bringing our hands to prayer at Heart Center. Namaste.